Got a new bag in the mail. It's a Hazard 4 takedown bag. You can fit a carbine uh, here broken down an AR-15 or you can fit it uh, a pistol right uh, type of you know they call them pistol but it's like 5.56 type rifles or um, uh, KSG shotgun, P90, things like that. Uh, it's a really neat bag. Um, it's from Hazard Ford. It's made with Cordura materials. Uh, show you pretty quick what comes in here. They got this zipper right here in the top for a small compartment. Talking about the zipper, they're kind of hard to open because they are. They has this cover on it, so. To open the zippers are kind of not as easy as normal zipper will be. Right here we got one compartment. It's a small compartment on the top. You can put here maybe uh, earplugs, sunglasses, and whatever. I have a second compartment here in, in the middle. Uh, double zipper. It has a suede type material. You can put patches or whatever you want if you like there. And it also in the inside is an open compartment with uh, also velcro here that you can stick things here like pouches or whatever you like uh, right underneath that there is another compartment with molar waving and also has velcro here double zipper again open that up and this one has like pockets for like pens or pencil flashlight uh, it has this double sided pocket that you can uh, rig it to open one side or the other because this is a sling pack goes against the back one only one strap so you can adjust that pocket to open sideways type thing alright on the side right here we got more molly webbing we have two buckles to, uh, to adjust the pack to uh, compact it The same in the opposite side, we have a carrying handle here. On the back side, we have the one full padded type sling. It comes in the center, not on the side. So you can configure it to be on the right or left handed by unclipping that and clipping it in the opposite side. It has one big bell buckle here with a uh, type of lock mechanism. Like one side is open, and you put it in the lock position, it won't come off. The opposite side is match, and the back side has ribs area. Uh, pretty nice looking pack. It has this type of keeper, so you can loop the SS webbing on there. Right here on the back, they call it concealed carry area. You open this zipper up, and you have a pretty big, big pocket here also. Now you can put a uh, to conceal a weapon or whatever you like. It's soft material here, plastic type of material in this side. Um, you can also add here a hydration bladder if you want. It has a compartment on the top for it to come out with a tube. And another zipper here if you want to put the hose in this side. So the main compartment, after you take these straps down, You open it up, you got two zippers above. You can rip it all the way down. When you open it all the way open, you find here these two buckles that will hold your rifle in place if you would like to choose those. Plus, this divider here that has Velcro. So if you break your rifle down and you have a, like a scope or optic, you might want to slide that here to keep it padded and protected. You uh, your scope, the glass, and then the rifle bottom half here. And then you can cinch it down and strap it. Uh, the inside part here is really soft material on the inside part. And then you have that other piece of uh, this other section that is also soft so I'm going to show you uh, what my rifle my pistol looks like in here so I got a, in here my pistol now this is the CZ Scorpion Evo and as you can see it fits perfectly from top to bottom 
and it is ha it has back here a chuck wave blade. So here's the whole pistol. It's simple. I didn't have to take it apart or anything. It fits perfectly inside the bag with a magazine. And here we have another option now. Uh, the bag is open. You open your bag and you have your KSG shotgun that fits perfectly in here. You have it all the way in. No, no need to take it apart, take it down or anything like that. It just fits. And it has a front pistol grip, the flip up sights, a sling on it. KSG fully loaded in your bag, ready to go. Now a full AR-15 16 inch barrel upper and lower would not fit in the back unless you take it apart. Split the upper and lower and then you can fit both in the back. And the problem is not going to be rapid deployment to be able to use it. You got to put the upper and lower back together but you can fit it in this bag. One thing I notice is if you have the compression straps on here and you're trying to rapid deploy this by ripping this out, ripping it open, the tabs will not allow that to happen. Um, next design, I, I guess that I will try to. One suggestion that I would think of it would be a way. I don't know how that when you try to rapid deploy this, this the cinch straps here will come open. By when you rip it, uh, maybe something here Velcro on that when you rip it, they will rip off, and then you'll be able to remove your rifle, your pistol out of here, your shotgun out of here quickly. That's a suggestion that I think it would be really nice to have. Uh, other than that, if you uh, you're gonna use this, carry it around, and you think you're gonna have to pull your gun out, you're gonna have to have this unstrapped and ready to go so when you rip it it will be easy able to come out and deploy your gun thank you for watching nc gun videos please remember to subscribe also check us out on facebook and twitter and give us a like on the video see you next week